Why are there two sets of dips on C and D? Two planets. Excellent. So you've discovered two different planets. Mr. Jeter, the astronomy teacher at Marjorie Stoneman Douglas High School, is helping students not only explore the universe, but explore their passion for learning as well. I started asking around if there's a class in astronomy, and I was stunned to find out that the county didn't offer a class in astronomy. And I knew this was kind of a revolutionary time in that field. And I thought, well, we have to have a class in astronomy. It's asking, you know, why are we here? Are we alone? I mean, these are just huge fundamental questions of our existence, and that's astronomy's goal. So we were the first astronomy class in Broward. Mr. Jeter provides a fun, interactive learning environment for students. His classroom is filled with student-made artwork of faraway galaxies, stars, and planets. His passionate, fun, and engaging teaching methods have been recognized by students and staff alike. Jeter was awarded Teacher of the Year in 2017. His creative take on education has led to his ever-growing large class sizes. I want to take astronomy next year because I heard Mr. Jeter is an awesome teacher. I want to take astronomy because of all the cool labs that Mr. Jeter does. Not only does Mr. Jeter inspire students inside the classroom, but outside of it as well. He sponsors projects such as the School Garden and Project Aquila. Marjorie's Garden was sort of started on a whim. We were watching, I was standing down the hallway watching them destroy the old portables. There were a whole bunch of portables out in that field. I'm standing there watching and I thought, huh, I wonder what they're going to do with this large space of land. And I just suggested to the principal at the time, like, hey, could we maybe set aside some land for science purposes. It's used for a whole variety of things. Mr. Davis's botany class, Ms. Rich's experimental science, they're out there building uh, new hydroponics units and running the hydroponics that we have already. Uh, my class, astronomy, uses it for astronomy nights. Other class, I've seen every type of class out there utilizing it. So Project Aquila is a high altitude balloon project that was started in 2010. Um, our goal is to send a, a, a craft you know, designed and built by students into the stratosphere about a hundred thousand feet high and to take pictures of things like the curvature of the earth, to take pictures of the black sky during the daytime. We want to get high enough that you're literally seeing space in the daytime. Teachers like Mr. Jeter are valuable and irreplaceable. Mr. Jeter inspires students to pursue their dreams. Some of his former students have even gone on to work for NASA and Blue Origin, two of the leading space exploration companies in the world. Thanks to teachers like Mr. Jeter, students are able to receive an out-of-this-world education in an engaging and fun way.